Hey everyone, Harris here with iDownloadBlog. So one of the biggest first world struggles of getting a new iPhone would be music. I'm often finding myself in a situation where I don't have service and I want to play a song but it hasn't been downloaded yet because when you get a new iPhone it does not restore downloads and Apple does not currently allow you to download all of your songs at once from your iPhone. I don't know why, that certainly seems like a feature that it would have. It does allow you to automatically download songs that you add to your library but there's no way of retroactively downloading all of your music unless you manually go through the albums, which depending on your library could take a long time. Now the solution to this is actually extremely easy, but the only caveat is that you do need a computer, but it can be Mac or Windows. So by default on iTunes, you are able to download all of your music with a control or command A and then right clicking and downloading it. That's really easy from iTunes on a computer. However, if you want to be able to do this on your phone, it's very simple as well. Go to File, New, and a Smart Playlist, and what you want to do is make a criteria of time of 0 seconds so that any song that is greater than 0 seconds, it will automatically add to this Smart Playlist, and you can have it actively refresh, so every time a new song is added, it will add it to this playlist. Now, if you have an iCloud Music Library set up, all you have to do is go to your iPhone, that album library will be instantly there. Whatever you named it, you just download that playlist, and now you automatically have all of your songs that are greater than zero seconds downloaded to your Apple device. And this will work cross device, so whether it is an iPhone, an iPad, or any iOS device, you will be able to download all of your music very simply with this trick. Again, the only thing that's needed is iTunes, but it takes about five seconds. It's a pretty convenient way of getting around this limitation on Apple Music. Don't know why Apple has this limitation, but there is an easy way around it. Anyway, I hope this quick tutorial helped. If it did, leave a comment and a like down below. Thanks for watching.